What's up guys, it's A4 here and welcome to VBC channel and the, tonight Oh yeah, it's evening here and yeah, I'm so sorry guys. so This video I'll do an in-depth review of start of this Super King Triple Booster set that it comes with Tempest Dragon itself and Curse Satan Naked Diabolus and here's a picture of drum and yeah don't mind the way it's at the back as I'll be reviewing that later and let's go over here and here's our here are the parts here you go this is Tempest Dragon Dragon Chip and Tempest 1A and Charge Metal and here's uh Cure Satan, there is here is Satan chip and Curse 1D and Aero Dash. Yeah, it's me. It's, I think I like Aero Dash though. And here's Hold Dash. And also, as you can see here, here's Diabolus chip, GT chip, Naked, and oh, Goku. Goku, Goku weight, it's a very heavy weight in good for combos. And here's 11 disc and wave drivers. Please don't mind the noises. They're like, like <laughs> that thing. It's just a, uh, <laughs> don't know why it's called, so I'm so sorry. So let's continue. Here are the base. So here's Naked Diabolus, as you can see here. Pretty dark blue. <laughs> and here's Curse Satan with a whole dash. I already put in the stickers on this set. Look at this. Tempest Dragon. So I'll be reviewing them one by one. So let's start with this one. Because this is the star of the set. Go. Here are all the parts lay out here. You go. I'm just sorry about <laughs> noise, guys. I'm so sorry. Hope you you understand. I'm so sorry. Oh, can we see or not? Oh, it's moving. Here you go. So these are all the parts. Let's start with the chip. So here's the chip. Uh, focus. Okay, here's the chip, and this is a very nice chip, though, because it's a combination of red, metallic red, and silver. Look at this. But it's just a normal chip, so <laughs> nothing, the nothing too special about it. So here's dragon. It has a nice combination of white color. Here you go, white color, blue color, and gold colors. Look at this. <laughs> it's pretty, pretty nice chip though. I really like it. <laughs> Dude, look at this. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> I really like uh, transparent things. And here you go. Here's a the Tempest layer base, I think. I, am I right? <laughs> Just comment in co comment section if I was right or not. <laughs> I'm so sorry, guys. So here you go. The gimmick of this layer base is basically if you push this harder, or an opponent pushed it harder in the battle, battle it will become in in awaken mode it will be in awaken mode with this just like that and yeah it has two wings though oh my god okay here you go will look like this 
and also this is also a bound wing here this part here so as an opponent hits this uh, this bay and this wing activated it will do another attack just like bound wing of uh should i say the imperial dragon and from valkyrie back in season season two i think and here's one a a pretty heavy disc for an attack type yeah but, and yeah it's good i think because it's only for right spin as you can see here this is an r and one a uh <laughs> logo here and yeah it has pretty good attack though but this is a pretty solid attack here and yeah it's pretty good against uh good stamina combos and here's charge metal this is pretty good though it has a navy blue or darker blue in color in person but in camera it looks normal, a normal blue like no it's darker actually it's darker i'm speaking honestly here and yeah as you can see here I don't have any charge driver yet because I don't have the set for set before and yeah I think they put it a lot of metal and in, in this driver and the thing that changed here is this the tip before like the charge driver they use a plastic tip here and it's a whole flat by the way so it will have great stamina let's put that there and let's put it together and by the way guys i'm just saying here you can activate you can actually activate the wings of tempest dragon if you launch it hard hard like hard enough to awaken this I think I'll do a video about it just comment there if you want though if you want a video about it like if you like I tested it a lot of times before reviewing this and yeah it really works I was using DB launcher so yeah try try it out out guys if you have the, if you have tempest dragon but let's do a comparison between this mq tempest dragon here you go guys so let's do a comparison about this so, i'm so sorry it will be a very long video i'm so sorry guys so here's the difference look at this This one has a uh, milky white, I think, and this one ha ha is only like plain white <laughs> color. And yeah, the only difference that I found is the springs inside the layer. It's pretty hard to awaken this or change this into awakened mode. Cause damn. That's pretty hard, and this one, we just slide it with no worries. Look at this. It's pretty dull in color, uh, but I just respect it. They did a pretty good job about this though. And oh, he won a chassis first. Okay, here you go. <laughs> one H as in here is left and right spin but they said it's R like <laughs> I'm not I'm not joking here I tried it tried it with uh, Fafnir and Hel Hel Helios so here you go you can see the difference it has screws and this has rivets and it's done Oh my gosh.
Okay. And here you go. Charge metal. <laughs> oh my god. The only difference here is this one has taller tip than this one. And this has a pretty dull color than this one. Light blue and very dark blue. So let's put this together and hear the clicks. It's not that hard, but it's fine because it has a double chassis though, so it's fine guys, don't worry about it. So let's put that back. So next is Super uh, Curse Satan. Oh my gosh, it has really tight lock though. Like, I'm not even joking here guys. I'm not lying here. Because it is a pretty good uh, clicks. I don't know what people hated for Satan. It's pretty good clicks though. There you go. All the parts laid out and first let's watch the chip the chip has let's speed this up so that you will not get bored and the chip has a grayish golden color to it and by the way guys it's not a transparent not transparent like other chips so yeah it's a pretty good chip to get to. and here's great satan chip I think that's score, right? Oh yeah, yeah, that's score. <laughs> I'm so sorry, guys. It's been a long time since I reviewed things like this. <laughs> I'm sorry about it. It has a pretty, pretty, very pretty, yeah, very pretty greenish color here. And oh, this thing, this thing, I like it the most. Is it just in army green, right? Army green color here, and the rollers are so nice to watch, and it kind of feel like it's fine. <laughs> and here's one D chassis. It's a single chassis, so you can put your disc like this. You can put this. Okay, and there you go. Here's Aero Dash. Very light disc. It's not that good for tournaments, but it has a pretty round. It is pretty round here. And it looks very pretty when you put a disc on it. I'm not. If you have Aero Dash, try it. You'll like it. <laughs> and here is Hold Dash. In attack, an attack driver that does uh, the same color with Extreme Dash, right? <laughs> the extreme the extreme dash that comes with uh, I think the uh, materials uh, materials please uh, uh, materials bay uh, but yeah this is a pretty good driver to use though I'm not I'm not lying here you can use this driver in longinus I think I think it's longinus uh, I think it's the Zwei layer base it's pretty good at pretty good with this and also but I mostly recommend using extreme dash on this Y layer base and let's put the bay together speed these things let's speed things up oh my gosh let's see the clicks oh <laughs> that's a pretty solid solid click though right you agree with me guys <laughs> and here is the abolos oh let's stop here the abolos and let's put this aside ah, i'm so tired <laughs> i'm so tired of uh. okay here you go let's not talk <laughs> i'm talking a lot <laughs> a lot of nonsense, nonsense, nonsense things. Here you go, the Diabolus chip, and I will not compare this with my Diabolus chip from the or original uh, 
dia boros ni go the teeth are yeah the same <laughs> oh my god and also it has a very good dark and red color and here's goku weight it's pretty good weight it is pretty good weight though like honestly I'm like yo i like this I like you. <laughs> Joking. Just kidding, guys. And yeah, here's it. The mm, the naked layer base from G GT. So this is from. I think this layer base comes from Naked Spriggan. Should I do a. Wait, I'll just get the Naked Spriggan first. Here you go. It's pretty good. Oh, do you get us uh, Star Wars vibes about this? Should I do a video about Star Wars video using this two layer base? You want, guys? Mm, I've been thinking it also. Mm, let me think about it. <laughs> there you go. And <laughs> that's done. And. Let's go over the parts again. And here's eleven. This not nothing so special about it. And this is also a tar star of the show. This is Wave Driver. So Wave Driver is basically like I think this this feels like gears here. And also it has a pretty uh, small tip here. And I wonder where we will we'll be. Uh, when we it will when it will be awakened. Hmm. Hmm. I think it's pretty good. <laughs> Just joking. I'll do a video about it. So I cannot promise though, but I'll try. So don't worry. Okay, here. Let's hear the clicks. Not that strong. Not that strong, but highly, I highly recommend this set for the parts. Here you go. Let's put this here for our. End. So thank you very much, guys, for watching. I know it's a bit long video, but I hope you understand all the things.